In this week's episode, I talk about the wind, I give you an update on my fitness progress and uh, all those other things that go with it, and I uh, add back a feature that got accidentally left out in episodes past. <laughs> Welcome to Blog Oklahoma. The Oklahoma Wind On any average day, you'll feel the wind on your face. Sometimes it's mild and calm, others it'll knock you over. The wind is power. All across the Oklahoma plains, tall white turbines are sprouting like flowers, spinning and turning in pinwheel-like fashion, generating electrical power, giving us light and air conditioning and all that comes with it on a smaller scale in a field nearby, is an old gray and rusted windmill, slowly spinning, driving a pump to bring up water from the depths to quench a thirsty herd of cattle. Smaller still are the wind chimes on your neighbor's porch, gently playing its calming meditative tune. Even smaller, you'll watch the flowers in your garden sway back and forth. On a day like today, you'll open up your windows and let the wind blow gently through the house. On a day like yesterday, you worried if the roof was going to stay on under the gale. On a day like tomorrow, you'll wonder what the wind will bring. Will it bring a nice, calming, relaxing day? Will it bring the kind of day where you want to head to the park with your kite like the old song, Let's go fly a kite? Or will it just blow in more of your neighborhood's trash into your yard? Will it bring the dust as it did in days past? Or will it bring the fear that the heavenly host has come for you on this day? That is the power of Oklahoma wind. And now it's time for the top five TV shows I just caught up with on my DVR this week. Number five. Texas Flippin' Move. <laughs> Number four, Legends of Tomorrow. Number three, Arrow. Number two, Supergirl. Number one, The Flash. I think there's a pattern here. Well, my fitness goals got off track a little bit this week, mostly because of the aforementioned wind. It was so windy over the week that I couldn't get out to walk, so... <laughs> I just stayed in and didn't walk. <laughs> so I missed a few days on my walk around the neighborhood. I am getting closer to my first goal of a 15-minute mile. My last walk came in at 17 minutes, so it's all good. Um, I have switched from RunKeeper to Runtastic on my iPhone to track my walks, but I didn't get to use it enough over the week to give you an adequate review of it, so I'll try that for next time. In other news, my yellow Jeep died again. If you recall, at the beginning of last summer, the radiator blew up. Not figuratively, literally. The radiator blew its top. Well, I got that replaced, and the Jeep was running fine up until last Tuesday. Now it won't start. <laughs> we think the starter went out. I need to get that replaced now. Oh, joy. <laughs> um, I've also... Uh, I've been leaving something out of the podcast lately that was something I really wanted to have in here since I started this thing, and that was the writing suggestions. I was going to share with you some topic or idea to write about in the week in case you were looking for something to write about. Well, I completely forgot about it in one episode, and somehow it made it out of my script template, and I haven't thought about it ever since until today. Oops. Well, I have it back in my script. I have it back in my script template, so I won't forget anymore. Sorry about that. Well, my, I'll, have, uh, I'll have the writing suggestion in what I call the notes section of the podcast. That's the bottom half of my podcast, and I'll keep an effort to make it in there this time. Speaking of the notes section. This week's Blog Oklahoma writing suggestion is to write a poem about the Oklahoma wind. 
I look forward to reading what you come up with. Are you someone who blogs in or about Oklahoma? Then you already qualify for WebRing membership. Join Blog Oklahoma today. Want to know more about Blog Oklahoma? Then just explore the WebRing and discover some of the best blogs and podcasts in the nation. Just visit blogoklahoma.com for more information. Did you know we have our own cafe press store? Of course you did. I mentioned it last week. Oh, wait, you're new here. Sorry. Did you know we have our own cafe press store? There you could purchase a t-shirt, coffee mug, and other great items with the Blog Oklahoma podcast artwork on them. Just head on over to cafepress.com slash podcast. I've added even more great music to the Blog Oklahoma bonus playlist. There are now well over seven and a half hours of music for you to enjoy. You can listen on Spotify or YouTube. I have links to them and more in the show notes at blogoklahoma.net. And thank you for listening to the Blog Oklahoma podcast. I'm happy to announce, as of April 10th, 2016, Blog Oklahoma has 904 registered Oklahoma bloggers. Your feedback is important, so please feel free to contact me with your comments or questions. You can get hold of me in a multitude of ways. Just visit blogoklahoma.net slash contact for more information. Check our show notes for all the links and bonus material from today's episode. This has been Kevin Latham for Blog Oklahoma. Until next time.